Well, we're gonna try an experiment here. So Hazel has, this is Rhea, everybody. She's never been properly introduced. And Hazel's got her fly mask on, but I've done a lot of research and finding out that zebra stripes confuse the flies. And that's why zebras don't have flies on them. So hopefully this will work. Um, from what I've been reading, flies see multiple things. So with zebra stripes, they get very, very confused. And I mean, fortunately, it'll help with where the zebra stripes are, but I don't know if it's gonna keep them away from her nose, but we're gonna try. I had to actually cut the ears out because obviously donkeys have larger ears and these were kind of made for horses. So now Hazel will be ready for Halloween if she wants to disguise herself as a donk, as a zebra. And we'll see what happens with these. rhea has been around flies for a long time. And can't be skeptical because- you Gotta try everything. Size, flies have become super flies. So far, she looks adorable. So far, I don't see a fly landing on the zebra stripes. Oh yeah, there's one right there. Yeah, they're more around her nose. Yeah. And these are actually pretty good because, uh, like Rhea was saying, these other ones are a little, they're heavier and they're very stiff and they do irritate or when they bend, they kind of stay in position. These are a little bit more lightweight, which I think is more, way more comfortable for them as well. But actually it's looking pretty good. I don't see any flies all over her face again. We're gonna get some fly sheets too in zebra stripes, so everybody at the ranch will be in zebra stripe. But see, they're on her mouth, obviously, so they're staying away from the eyes, which is really important. Um, it's fitting up pretty well. And there's Moo. Yeah, Moo got, Moo's got a lot of flies on him. I think this is a good fit. I mean, it might be a little bit small under here, but so we wanted to share that with you. And Hazel's eating a little hay out of the back of the gator here. Um, I think she looks pretty damn cute with her zebra stripes on. You're gonna really, you're gonna confuse Doc. Doc the zebra is gonna be really confused when you go walking by. She's gonna be like, who's that hot little zebra right there? Or half a zebra. We'll have to order Doc a donkey outfit for Halloween. Yeah. So we'll change the zebra into a donkey and the donkey into a zebra. We'll see what happens. A lot of shenanigans here at the ranch. Mm. And people have been asking about the dogs. Dingo, come here. Dingo, come here. That's Dingo. And Dingo came from Australia. Rhea rescued him in the big Australian fires and she brought him back from Australia. So far, so good with Hazel's zebra striped fly mask. Now we'll go put them on the rest because we got a bunch of fly masks to put on people. Now it's Heaven's turn. Heaven's gonna be quickly transformed into a zebra. Get rid of those nasty flies on her face. Ooh, she looks pretty. Yeah, Heaven, you look really pretty with this on. Yes. Oh, look at you. you. Look at Heaven. Woo! <laughs> All right. Who is that? That's a pretty girl. A heavenly zebra. And now it's Uncle Johnny's turn. This is Uncle Johnny. Uncle Johnny is going to be transformed into a zebra. Voila, look at that. And you look quite handsome, Uncle Johnny. Yes, you do. Quite handsome. How are you liking it? I think they all look pretty cute as zebra. I think they do too. Yeah. Let's see who else can use a zebra mask. Well, actually the old man, rats can right there. Okay, we're gonna do one more. This is Rats. He's 32. Rats is getting a zebra stripes. And he is getting his zebra stripes. He is notorious for getting his bonnets off. Look how handsome you look. But he man. might just like this one and he'll say, you know what? I kind of dig this one. It's going to stay. Handsome boy. Yeah, look at you. Handsome, handsome boy. We're going to confuse those flies. Confuse the flies. Because that's what happens. So the zebra stripes 
actually confuse the flies. Because according to what I've read, the flies see multiple things. So when you see the stripes, they're just so confused by it, they just avoid them. And it seems to be working pretty well. So practice at home. We're gonna confuse the flies. <laughs> oh, we're so amused. Lily's. Look at Lily just looking really handsome. I mean, that's not Lily. That's Uncle I'm sorry. Johnny. Uncle Johnny. Uncle Johnny looking really handsome. And Uncle Johnny is confusing the flies. <laughs> that's the new thing. Confuse the flies. I thought this was the cutest thing in the world. Two best friends, Hazel and Lily, and they both have their fly masks on. They're both disguised as zebra today. Seems to be working well. Um, at least their eyes are protected. They got a little bit of flies on their on their nuzzles and everything else, but it seems to be doing a job. So I think the zebra straps are pretty successful so far. Lily, look up. Tell everybody how cute you look. I look really cute. Hazel, look up. Speak. Leave me alone. I'm eating. I'm eating right now. <laughs> That's all she's ever doing. Yep, munching away. Disguise the zebra. There we go. 